I'm Tay Anderson, and I'm the facility manager with the Charlotte Rescue Mission Doves Nest. And Doves Nest is the women's facility of Charlotte Rescue Mission. Um, and we're a 12-bed facility. We house women that are homeless or about to be homeless due to alcohol and drug addiction. We don't accept any children here. That's my downfall, but we do help um, a lot of people, not just in this community. We have people from all over. We had a lady in from California. We have people from New York. We get a lot of our clients from South Carolina, so we help people all over. And um, I don't know. It's just this program is really, really unique in the fact that we try to mesh the 12 steps of recovery mm -hmm. with Christian principles and that we feel gives our clients the uh, foundation they need to go out and be successful. Plus, we're a four and a half months program where a lot of other programs are 28, 14 days and then we have a continuing care division that is, um, they can go and stay there and work for up to eight months. Hmm. So our program um, is possibly a year long program. Sure. Now how do they typically find out about you? We get referrals from probation officers. We get people from um, the court systems. Usually it's word of mouth. Mm -hmm. And um, then um, a lot of people just call on their own. And, and we do operate from a waiting list because we are 12 beds, we are free, and we are long term. That's just unheard of. Mm -hmm. So we do operate from a waiting list. And a waiting list can be from six to eight weeks long. Do you seek volunteers at all or also oh, in terms absolutely, of fundraising? Absolutely, yes. We, um, we don't accept any United Way or state funding, mm -hmm. so we operate off of volunteers. They support us, volunteers and churches, and so we have lots and lots of volunteers, and our volunteers are crucial to us. Great. Now, where can people find you webs on a website? Um, you just need to go to www.charlotterescuemission.org. Okay, great. Well, thank you.